he didn't think she'd find out. Wow. Okay. Well, that's completely fine then. Obviously, you loved her very much. It's just at that particular moment, ejaculating was a little bit more important to you than her sanity or well-being. And now this is happening. A chain of events that's going to culminate in the miracle of childbirth. And it's going to grow up and it's going to behave just like you. And it's going to leave behind armies of sobbing women. Give me your phone. Give me your phone. Give me your phone. I want to talk to her. I want to apologise to her because when we had sex, I thought how sad you seemed, like how lonely and desperate and how much you missed me and how horrific this two-dimensional idiot fiancé of yours must be, but I bet she's lovely. I bet she's just extremely nice. Give me your phone. Give me your phone. I, this day, this day, this fucking wedding day that she has planned her whole life. And now here I am, my fucking belly swelling by the minute. The evidence that her entire world is bullshit. She'll probably off herself. She'll be one of those people under a train. One of those station announcements. I would. I fucking would. I'd open up every vein and I'd paint on the walls big and red. This is not a cry for help. Give me your phone. When did I become this person? I used to be a good person. And now I'm evil. I'm actually evil. Give me your phone. Give me your phone. I'm serious. Give me your phone. Give me your phone. Give me your fucking f No, you know what? You're right. I don't think I'd handle it well. <laughs>